What's going on guys? So today we are reviewing the new Session Pan from 10,000. So let's jump right into it. Now quick disclaimer, I am an ambassador with 10,000, but they did not ask nor did they pay me to make this video. I just wanted to give my honest thoughts and opinions on the pants. So a brief background about the Session Pan is that it is basically just the pant version of the Session Short. So a lot of the same things that the Session Short has as far as the zipper, the waistband, all of that has been translated perfectly over to the pan. And so with these Session Pants, you're getting that same exact material that's ultra lightweight, it's 86% polyester, 14% spandex, so there is a little bit of a stretch, but it's not super stretchy at the same time either. The pants have three full zippers, so you have your two, one on each side, regular size pockets, and then you also have a mini uh, zip pocket on the side that's very similar to the Session Short as well that you can put keys or small items in. You also have one pocket that's relatively decent size on the back end that's on the inside of the pant. The one thing I don't like about this pocket is that you can really clearly see the outline on the back side, which I think doesn't look the best, but at the same time, it doesn't destroy the aesthetic and at least gives you another option to hold something. You have perforated panels on the calves on the back side for breathability, and then you also have these ankle zips that are great for getting shoes on and off easily as well. When it comes to the waistband, like I said, it's the exact same waistband as the Session Short, so if you like that there, you're probably gonna like it here. I personally do like it. I feel like it holds its shape and form pretty well. It's pretty breathable, it, it wicks sweat pretty well, and it also has like a nice little woven aesthetic to it. And the last thing about the materials, just like all clothing from 10,000, it is sweat wicking and anti-odor treated. So how did they perform? How did they do in running conditions, since that's mostly what these are made for? and I thought they were perfect for those chilly evenings, those 40 to 60 degree days to where it's a little too chilly to just wear shorts, and you wanna wear a thinner, lightweight pant. This is perfect for that. It's super lightweight, it stays out of the way, it doesn't get kind of clunky or uncomfortable when you're striding. It's also nice that it has all these different zippers because you can carry a, a couple items. Now obviously if you're running, you don't want to carry big bulky items that are jumping around, but the small pocket is great to kind of secure the keys to your body so even if you have heavier keys, they're not going to be jumping around as much. And the pockets to me are nice because if you're running from, let's say you go from the gym to the grocery store, you're going place to place and you need to hold your phone or different items, you have those pockets to do so whereas in the session short alone, you didn't have pockets before, so I'm glad that they added that to these pants. Now one question some of you may be wondering that have some clothes from 10,000 is how do they compare to the interval pant, which came out about a year ago and is more of their versatile all around pant. How does the session pant compare? Well, I'll say for running, I'd go session pant. I think it's lighter weight, it's gonna stay out of the way and be more what you're looking for but for more all around use for lifting, or if you just want something that's a little bit more stretchy, a little bit thicker material, a little warmer, the interval pant is your go-to. I mean, I think you could wear this, I wore this last year, and you know, 30 to 40 degree temperatures without too much problem. If I wore these and that, I'd probably have to wear compressions underneath just to make sure I'm layered and warm enough, but Either way, you can't go wrong with either. It just depends exactly what you're looking for and how you would utilize them. So overall, I found the Session Pant to meet the high standards that are set forth with that $98 price tag. They come available in this light gray, or you can get them in black as well. And if you'd like, you can save 15% off by using my code. It's code Covington, and I'll save you 15% off your entire order. All right, that's it for this review. If you have any questions at all about the pants, how they performed, or about any other clothes from 10,000, you can leave them in the comments and I'll get back to you soon. Thanks for watching, and I'll catch you guys in the next one.